happy birthday to me another orbit around the sun and uh look here cycle fanatics swung by the house to wish me happy birthday on his way down to uh daytona bike week uh-oh somebody's got a sad story anyway we're heading out to uh fredericksburg volts and i to hook up with the guys to have a birthday barbecue lunch so come along check out his channel if you're not already following him <laughs> see you later man you gave the oh my god i gave him the bike and took the dust so he was not handling my shit he took it out like the okay i don't know what's going on but we should get out of here <laughs> Well, we made it to Fredericksburg. The meetup point here is uh, Eats, a burger joint. If you're ever in the area and you want a good burger, come to Eats, a burger joint. Check out that little scooter, man. Anyway, Volt is gonna lead the way. The guys are over here. We're gonna head over, meet uh, Jake, and uh, grab some barbecue. I don't know. I think I think at this point today, maybe do I do I qualify for the uh, old people's menu? What do you think? Kids menu? No, it's not the kids menu. I think I think I can order off the old people's menu now. He can. He's like said You can order off the old people's menu. Right. People know actually how old I am. <laughs> so, yeah, John Doe and Moto Ricky Ricardo who changed his name to Rick on the Discord and threw me for a loop because I saw something from a Rick that said I'll be there and I'm like okay whatever I don't know who you are but, but it's my good buddy Ricky how that motherfucker keeps that matte paint looking the way it does but that's a immaculate looking matte paint look out barbecue here we come man she's got a lot of chunk in that trunk the car a lot of stuff in that car trunk now this is the barbecue joint look at that looks like a I mean that's just a Mexican place it's supposed to be what all right after a false stop or start here we are at almonds big time barbecue fucking apple let us down again oh uh, good thing I had a Google map I'm thinking I'm thinking uh, Walter had an operator error because that was the 400 block Man, oh man, what a great day today. What a great birthday day. Had a really enjoyable time. Surprise start off to the day with meeting Cycle Fanatics. Uh, super cool dude. I'll put a link to his channel down uh, in the description down here. If you love motorcycles and wrenching on motorcycles, make sure you check out his channel. But yeah, we ended up uh, going to Fredericksburg and met up at Eats Burger, super cool place in Fredericksburg. And then uh, just sat down and had a great time with the guys, eating barbecue and catching up and chatting, talking bikes, talking life. It was, uh, it was a good time. I want to thank Volts and Mr. John Doe and 
<laughs> Stage two, baby. And Moto Ricky Ricardo and Jake for meeting up with me today. Yeah, making this day a little special. It's definitely a special birthday for me. After eons of lying about my age, people ask me how old I am now, and you know what? I'm, I'm gonna own it. I'm gonna own it. I just completed my 62nd orbit around the sun. 62 orbits. Wow. How did that happen so quickly? I went from being a young man, rebel rouser, rule breaker, troublemaker. Uh, as Miss Percy will tell you, I'm 18 going on 63, at least in my head. But suddenly, uh, yeah, you turn around and realize that your social security, uh, social security years old. <laughs> And I remember when I was like in my late 20s and most of my uh, professional peers were in their 40s and 50s. And I used to think, God, if I ever get that old, please just take me out back and shoot me. But you know, it's not really about getting that old. It's about acting that old, I think. I certainly don't feel like uh, like I act my age. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I'm still enjoying life, making every day an adventure, trying to live every orbit around the sun as best I can. Not just for me, but also to put whatever good kindness, goodness, whatever out in the world for others. You know, I think that's a really important part of living your life. You know, we all have a choice to make, a lot of choices to make in life, but one choice we, we each have to make as an individual is either you put out love into the world or you put out hate. You know, that's just the fact of life. And hopefully there are more of us that choose to put out love than there are to put out hate and the world keeps being a better place I know for me personally I'm a lucky man I'm, <clears throat> I'm lucky in a number of ways but one of the ways in particular is that I work with young people <coughs> excuse me I work with young people every day from God I couldn't tell you how many countries young people from all over the world. I try to learn from them every day. I try to share my experience with them every day. And I guess what I take out of all of that is I see that there's a, there's a whole group of humanity coming up behind us all that I really do believe will end up making the world a much better place than what we gave them as we were coming up. So I find hope in that and joy. This is the year for me. Uh, I've delayed my kind of change in life by several months, but uh, definitely I am transitioning into a different stage of life. And I'm really looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to having uh, a lot more time to spend with Miss Percy, a lot more time to engage with the world on a, maybe a broader scale than, than what I've done, you know, in the previous decades. I've got a lot of exciting things coming up. Um, I'm looking forward to going out to uh, Wisconsin with Volts in July for the big Harley-Davidson 120th anniversary gathering. <coughs> We're going to be heading out there and checking out all the concerts over that weekend and meeting a bunch of people. There are a lot of folks I know that are going out there, um, fellow YouTubers and non-YouTubers, and I'm looking forward to hooking up with you guys there. And then, of course, we have the Five Dirty Bikers meetup in September in Louisville, Kentucky, where we will be 
raffling off and, and giving out uh, a very special motorcycle that we've been working on with Jared Weems for like the last eight months. There'll be more information about that coming up on the channel. And uh, then the big plan is next, uh, next year, this time next year, as I complete my 63rd orbit, Volts and I are talking about celebrating and heading down to Florida, where we'll kind of operate out of Orlando and, and uh, check out Daytona Bike Week. But we also plan to ride down to the Keys. It's kind of a bucket list thing that we've been talking about for quite some time. And hitting up the southernmost point of the U.S. And I'm really super excited about that. So lots of cool stuff coming over the course of the next year oh and how the hell could i forget how could i forget so the big trip coming up this year yeah wisconsin's not it is i'll be heading out to sturgis this year for the first time that's crazy 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 so my buddies and i at the five dirty bikers have hooked up with the lovely folks that run the Iron Horse Inn out in Whitewood, South Dakota. And we're going to be heading out to Whitewood. Uh, we'll be there the first week, or at least the first five days or so of Sturgis operating out of the Iron Horse Inn in Whitewood. And uh, really looking forward to that trip. I'll be heading out. I'll actually be arriving around the 1st of August and hanging out until the 8th or so. So, yeah, if you're going to be out at Sturgis this year, let me know. Maybe we can hook up. Definitely looking forward to being out there. Looking forward to sharing a lot of this time with Sophie here and uh, getting out and seeing people. But anyway, I just wanted to say, hey, thank you. I know a lot of folks have already reached out on the Five Dirty Biker Discord and on Facebook and any other number of ways to wish me a happy birthday. Thank you very much. I look forward to experiencing Orbit 63 with you guys over the next 12 months. Oh man, stage two. I, you know, I haven't even dropped the video yet about the, uh, the stage two, so you know something's coming. Got a special video that I'm almost done editing around that upgrade. But baby <laughs> what a difference a stage two makes anyway i don't want to bore you anymore you guys have a great day to my birthday twinsie you know who you are i wish you the best i hope you're having a great day like i am today how did we get this old so quickly i have no idea but you know as long as we keep living young we will be young so you guys take care. I'll talk to you later. Nice bike. Peace.